Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here? And what we have here, we take the log on both sides. At this here, we have log a raised to power x equals to log a t from here. At this here, we apply the power law of logarithm. When we have log m raised to power p, this same thing as p log m. At this here, this becomes x log 8 equals to log 80 from here. Then, next step here, we divide both sides by log 8. That is, divide this side by log 8. Also, divide this side by log 8, which implies that log 8 cancel each other. And we have x equals to log 80 over log 8. Then from here, we can rewrite 80 as 8 times 10. Then what we have becomes x equals to log 8 times 10 over log 8. Then here, yeah, we apply the log logarithm. When we have log a times b, the same thing as log a plus log b. At this here, we have x equals to log 8 plus log 10 over log 8. Then here, we separate this into two fractions, and we have x equals to log 8 over log 8 plus log 10 over log 8, which implies here log 8 cancel each other. We have 1 left, and x now equals to 1 plus log 10 over log 8. Then Next step here, also 10 can be written as 2 times 5. Then what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 times 5 over log 8. That is, this also follows the law of logarithm. And we have x equals to 1 plus log 2 plus log 5 over log 8. That is, here we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to 1 plus log 2 over log 8 plus log 5 over log 8. Then from here, it's same thing as 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 is to power 3. And what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 over log 2 is to power 3 plus log 5 over log 2 is to power 3. Then here we apply the power of log 3 comes here and also here. Then we have x equals to 1 plus log 2 over 3 log 2 plus log 5 over 3 log 2. That is from here, log 2 cancel each other. And this becomes x equals to 1 plus 1 over 3 then plus, and write this as well as 1 over 3 times log 5 over log 2. Then from here, 1 plus 1 over 3, same thing as 4 number 1 over 3, which is same thing as 4 over 3. And we have x equals to 4 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 5 over log 2. Then here yeah, we apply change of base. When we have log a over log b, this is the same thing as log a 
to base b. So this here we have x equals to 4 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 5 base 2. Then we bring this together as one fraction and we have x equals to the SCM here that's 3. Here we have 4 then plus log 5 base 2. That is the value of x here we have x equals to 4 plus log 5 is 2 all over 3. Then let's check here. If this satisfies this given problem, that is, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 4 plus log 5 is 2. All over 3. Then what we have here becomes 8 is to power 4 plus log 5 is 2 over 3. This is equals to 80 on this side. That is here. We can write 8 as 2 raised to power 3, which is raised to power 4 plus log 5. Is 2 all over 3. This is equals to 80 from here. Then here, yeah, this power multiplies. This cancel each other. We have 2 raised to power 4 plus log 5 is 2. This is equals to 80 on this side. And this follows. What we have a is to power m plus n. This same thing as a is to power m times a is to power n. This here we have 2 raised to power 4 times 2 raised to power log 5 is 2. This is equals to 80 on this side. And 2 raised to power 4 to multiply itself 4 times. 16 and 10. This follows on we have a raised to power log b to base a, which is equals to b. This here we have 5. This is equals to 80 on this side. And 16 times 5 plus 80, which is equals to 80 from here. But this left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to 4 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget this step. Subscribe for more videos. And turn the inscription bell. Share this video. Give it a thumbs up and put your comment. See you next class and bye for now.